Aspirin isn't just a medicine for people, it actually comes from plants. The story starts thousands of years ago. People all around the world used willow bark to treat pain and fever. Ancient Egyptians, Chinese healers, and indigenous peoples all discovered the same thing. Willow bark works. In the 1800s, chemists figured out why. Willow bark contains salicin which the body converts into an acid form, the same compound that became the foundation for modern aspirin. Now fast forward, in 1897, a German chemist named Felix Hoffmann, working for Bayer, synthesized what we know today as aspirin. Throughout this whole video, I'm going to use the word aspirin loosely to cover a bunch of terms like salicin, salicylic acid, and acetylsalicylic acid, because I like simplicity. Nothing turns my brain off faster than hearing something like phenolic, phytochromic, mediated, systemic acquired, resistance, signaling, pathways, strung together like it's supposed to mean anything to normal people. And I'm pretty sure Bayer doesn't mind me saying aspirin a whole bunch of times. 